Okay, so today I wanted to try and build something kind of worshipy for the pod go. Like many of these tones, I feel like the good place to start with this is like a vo. And we're going for a bit of a darker tone to start with. And something that doesn't get spiky. So the kind of main factors here, I've got the range master here, um, which is going to cut out some bass and So you could alter that if you want to keep a bit more of the bass in there. But the Range Master was kind of one of the first drive pedals and does behave nicely with the Vox, which is why I've chosen that one. Um, so that's down there on switch B. Then we've got the amp is the Essex A30, drive at 5, bass at 5, cut at 1, treble at 5, and that's all we're doing there. I might turn down this hum slightly to avoid things that sound like a ground loop. And you see if you've got this drive here, um, what I'm doing is the drive parameter is controlled by foot switch 3 with a minimum value of 5, max of 7.5 for like a gain boost. And then equally, there's like a bright boost from 5 to 8.4 on foot switch 1. So if we go to this view, you've got treble and drive. So you can hear. That you can switch that in or out. And then equally with the drive, I can go. So we're starting off dark, but you can equally, as you're playing, kind of kick on extra drive or treble with those foot switches, which is quite handy. We're going into the 2x12 Bluebell, which is a Vox kind of 2x12 speaker. We've got the 160 ribbon, distance 1.5, the high cut all the way down at 3 kilohertz. So I looked at some of the examples of what some of the worship kind of people have been doing. And one of the key things that I think is in common for most of them is that they're using quite dark uh, cabs, which you can do the same sort of thing with the stock cabs, it just involves taking this high cut down to a 3 kilohertz. There's a 6 dB per octave cut on that, so it's not actually cutting all the way down to 3 kilohertz. It's a bit more tame than it looks. The early reflections are at 30%. The thing that I wish the Pod Go has, but it doesn't, is dual cabs, because then you could balance this thing out and have like a brighter cab balance with a, a darker cab but you can't do that on the podgo it's quite frustrating um that's one thing that i really miss on the podgo because i've started using it more and more in the main helix and then we're using the transistor tape the time is a quarter note feedback 54 the wow flutter 4.7 and we've got the scale at 100 spread at 7.8 mix at 27 and the headroom all the way up to 12 db so that we're not clipping that at all trails on and then into the dynamic hall, which is pretty much default settings, except the decay is up at 7 seconds, room size is at 30 meters, diffusion at 100%, and damping taken up to 10 kilohertz. The mix down at 15%, because that can get a bit overwhelming. Again, trails on. And we've got a block free here for you to do what you like with. So I think this could be like a good starting point for a Podgo kind of worship tone. <laughs> Just quite dynamic uh, and all of that sort of thing. Now, of course, you can build that for yourself free or you can ask me in the comments to drop it into the folder. But feel free to share it around, you know, as 
I'm not trying to just make loads of money off of this. The idea is that hopefully I'm able to share something which helps you get somewhere closer to the tone that you had in mind with the Podgo or the Helix, whatever you're using. And uh, yeah, all of my presets can be found in the folder for three pounds and one pence for the Podgo and you get updates as many as you want, you know, so all of my tones going forward, I'm not changing the policy on any of that. But yeah, let me know how you get on with that, share it around. Hopefully that's a tone that you enjoyed. Uh, it seemed for me to work quite well with single coils. You'll notice probably it's fairly dark, but once you get that in front of a louder speaker, I'm hoping that that won't suddenly turn into a, a, a spiky thing, which can tend to happen, I think. But if you're finding it too dark, equally chuck up on this treble boost. Catch you in another video shoot soon. <laughs> Please share this around. Cheers.